what's good y'all so i'm about to break down that sample right now so let's get straight into the breakdown right here. i start off with this little midi in omnisphere so the preset is from the unclean machine bank made by spectrosonics themselves i went with the celeste de lune this preset right here I added a EQ, uh, Dirt did the days, this preset is crazy, and a little pan man, but here's what it sounds like with the effects. It's really simple, F sharp minor to a C sharp minor, so it's like a 1-5 progression. And even up here, if you look really closely, this is a F sharp, and this is also a C sharp minor, but uh, let me just pitch them up so I can show you. So basically this is a F sharp minor, cause right here you see now we got an f sharp minor but this note is not in it and this you might not be able to tell it's a c sharp minor but if we pitch down this and place a note here you can see it's a c sharp minor but without this note and this one inverted so you just gotta try out different inversions bro try to pitch stuff up here and there all right so the second preset is also from omnisphere same bank this is the circuit tears pad uh, i turned off the effects on this one and i turned off the b oscillator as well and for the effects, I added a reverb and two EQs right here. But for the pattern, as you can see, it's just a half step. It just goes from A to G sharp. This pattern is kind of just like a layer. It added some energy to the samples. I'm going to play them both together right now. So yeah, we got, we got a little bell going on. We got some uh, cool ambient pads going on with the layering. So after that, I went to Contact and I went to Noir Pierre. You already know, Dark Preset, filling out the root notes. So after I had these three, I went to Coop the Truth uh, Manifestation one-shot kit and I found this electric ukulele. Ukulele, ukulele, ukulele. Ukulele. I found this one right here. And I dragged it in and I pitched down 600 semitones. And then I duplicated it and pitched the other one up 600 semitones. So there's one octave in between these two. So I routed them both to mixer channel 15 over here. And I just added a little EQ. Now it just sounded cool when I had them go up and down. I'm gonna just show it to you. I don't know, it sounds weird now, but together with the other melodies, it sounds kind of cool. So after I had this, I added three different counter melodies, so let's go over them. So the first one is also from Coop the Truth. Same kit right here, it's the second one at the top, Adrian Coke Bottle Hit. And the original sounds like this. I'm gonna pitch it down 700, and now it sounds like this. I also added a little bit of reverb to it, some EQ here and there. And a little bit more EQ here. Uh, so that's the A section. The B section is right here. I added a little uh, counter melody. This counter melody is also from Omnisphere and it's from the same bank again, the Unclean Machine Bank. The preset is Heated JP Lead. I stuck with the first preset right here and I made this pattern with it. Yeah, so the end the effects is just some EQs, boost a little bit here, and a reverb. And then I made another pattern with the same uh, instrument, same preset and everything, but in another section. So let me just pull up that pattern. This one right here, same instrument, same effects. Yeah, I rendered both of them to 12 because they were the same preset. I added a little filter just to cut out some, like uh, remove some of the highs. So I added a low pass filter and a EQ. Yeah, so that's the that's the melody. Uh, hope thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it, and I'm gonna catch y'all in the next video. Have a good rest of your day. Peace out.